Ankit Ashish, what should one do? Hey, Mangala, morning to you and the viewers. Uh, see the overall pullback that we are seeing. I'm seeing this is a pullback. I'm not seeing this like a fresh start and we, the bottom is in place. It's too soon to conclude that. I think 16200 is going to be a very important hurdle. Uh, having said that, there is has, there has been a put writer's activity seeing at 16,000. So it seems that we at least have short-term low in place. And given that uh, any dips from here towards the level of 16,050, 16,060 can be possibly used as a buying opportunity, keeping a stop loss of somewhere around 15,950 and then expecting index to touch somewhere around 16,250. So buy on dips can be the strategy for the short-term trade. Do not carry the long positions because you know Every time we have moved with nearly around 300 to 500 point gap down that has happened over the past few days of time. And if you are brave enough to hold on to the position, you, have, you would have lost a lot of amount. So it's better to trade intraday. This is an intraday trader's market, not positional trader's market right now because we are seeing reversals here, uh, on the upside and also on the downside. So uh, buy on dips is the strategy for the day on the index for me today. Okay, all right. Uh, got that, Ashish. Buy on dips is the strategy. What about the stop loss? I missed that. Uh, the stop loss is going to be 15,950, 15, which is just below that 16,000 psychological level. Okay, so that's a good 170 points away from current levels. What about individual stocks? Uh, on the buy side, we have Tata LXC. Uh, we can clearly see IT has uh, shown some outperformance and Tata LXC has shown a very decent recovery. From the, from the lows and made a higher a higher low, about to give a breakout on the upside. So Tata LX is the first stock to buy. Stop loss at 6525, target at 7300. And the next stock on the sell side is going to be Whirlpool. We can see that that stock is beaten down and there is just no relief rally despite of index recovering 500 points from yesterday. Whirlpool is touching the new low. So it's better to be shorting the underperformer and Whirlpool is one of such candidates. Stop loss at 1630. Target at 1455. All right, it's just midweek and we have United Breweries, which has spiked to the high point of trade as we speak. And uh, Pyramid Enterprises as well from the broad markets doing well. Ashish, thank you so much for joining in and giving us your views on the index as well as individual stocks. With that, we shift focus to a fundamental call, an idea for profit coming in from our colleagues at Money Control Pro. Nitin Agarwal joins in with a stock that he's been tracking closely. company that I have chosen is 